All right, so in today's video, I'm going to be answering Luis Fernando Key's question. So he's asking, click funnels, do you use an app of tracking like Trackify or you only use the spaces that click funnels has? Okay, great question. So click funnels tracking. So basically, all you got to do to track in click funnels is um, first you go to your first you create a Facebook pixel in the pixel section of the business manager. Over there, you click create custom conversion in the pixel in the pixel section and over there um, all you gotta do is like click the the bar at the top the option at the top that says like use standard standard events and then you go, you, you go and see the the button that says like view email pixel code something like that and that's the code you wanna you wanna grab so you wanna copy all of that paste it like in, in a word document or in a text edit document and uh, once you paste it um, you just have to follow the video over there in the in the business manager that explains how to use the different events and paste them into the to that code. So you just wanna um, there's like a space in the between in the middle of the code uh, line that says script. So you just put the mouse be, be, before the script and you enter some spaces and above that you put the pixel tracking code that you wanna track. So I know this sounds a bit complicated, but just follow what Facebook is. Um, telling you to do now it's very simple uh, for the different events so in the in the landing page you would use the one that says view content so you'd use the pixel with an, the piece of code with the line code that says view content you would paste it in the landing page um, in the landing page there's a space that's like uh, tracking pixels and you'd paste it like in the header and then on the thank you page you would paste um, the same thing except you would substitute the view content coding line with the one that says lead so every time somebody goes to the thank you page, Facebook marks it as a lead. The point is like for every different pixel objective, Facebook will mark it um, as, the, as the line that you have in the, on that page. So view content would be for the landing page, lead would be for the thank you page. If you have something else, you can use like another line like um, registration, complete registration. So uh, basically all, you don't need an app. All you gotta do is um, use the spaces ClickFunnel provides and uh, Make sure you set it up that way because you have to make sure that on the pixel in Facebook, you select custom custom conversions, I think it is, because that's going to give you the code that works for ClickFunnels. For some reason, if you grab like the other code, it's not going to work. So um, that's basically how you track in ClickFunnels. Man, you don't need an external app, but the main thing you got to keep in mind is that you got to keep the tracking in place before you start any campaign. Make sure it's tracking and uh, to make to see if it's working or not you just go to google drive download the uh, to google chrome download the facebook pixel helper app and with that app basically it'll show you on the page if the pixels are working if they are working it will show on the landing page like page view view content there are two pixels on the thank you page it will show page view and lead if you install the lead on the thank you page and that's pretty much it. I know this sounds a bit complicated, but if, if you need any help with this or anyone watching this video, hit me up. I'll help you out with the tracking. But the only thing you gotta do is paste the pixel codes in the pages you're using of the funnel and then check it with Google Chrome. And that's pretty much it. Um, that's all you gotta do to make sure the tracking is correctly. Then run some tests, make sure it's performing as you want. And then just drive traffic on Facebook. But like I always say, tracking is the number one thing you gotta make sure it's pro um, installed properly if you're running a campaign because you wanna make sure you track all your numbers, all your clicks, all your leads, etc. And uh, that's pretty much it, man. That's how you set it up. Um, if you need any help, I know this might sound yeah, kind of complicated. It's really simple once you have it dialed in, but uh, the Facebook is gonna show you like a small video on how to do it. Um, but anyways, if you need any help, just send me a message and I'm going to gonna help you out with this. Um, but absolutely, I mean, ClickFunnels is an amazing software. I love creating funnels with ClickFunnels. The landing page templates, the webinar templates, the thank you page templates, they're amazing. They are super easy to use. And um, the more you use it, the easier it will become. Uh, the more you play around with ClickFunnels, with, uh, with its settings, setting up... Um, checkout pages, everything. It's just mind blowing. If you like learn how to create profitable funnels, it's one of the most important skills 
you want to learn online because if you don't learn how to create a profitable funnel and you know how to drive leads, target traffic to that funnel, you're going to make money. It's like putting $1 in and taking $1 out. It's like a machine you create. But first, you got to test out. You got to learn, spend a lot of money before you can do that. So don't think like it's just like magic, okay? It's a skill you got to learn. The more time you spend working on it, the more, the better you will become at it and the more money you will make. So that's it. Hope I answered your question. If you or anyone else have any more questions watching this video, just make sure you write them below in the comments. I'll answer it on a separate video and I'll see you in the next one.